Welcome Classic Rock fans for another unboxing and uh, like the uh, Heavy Horses release it's a, it's a much anticipated um, unboxing and that's the deluxe edition of Marillion's Brave. Um, I mean even before I've taken the cellophane off it, it looks like a, a, a really sort of a real quality item as far as I'm concerned so let's let's unravel it shall we. Oh, it's fabulous. I love new stuff. And straight away, one thing that um, strikes you is the, the feel of it. It's, um, it's just a quality item. Um, very much like the Tull uh, reissues. Uh, one thing that really is striking is the, the quality of the, the cover production. Really, It's absolutely stunning. It really is absolutely stunning. I've always loved uh, the, the cover of Brave, especially the fact that the Marillion logo is very understated um, uh, and stark, uh, very much like the album itself in fact. Um, it was a departure away I think from the kind of fish era, fish led era of Marillion. And of course Brave I think follows, if, I, if, if I'm uh, not wrong, I think it follows Holidays in Eden which is an album that um, just felt a little bit too poppy for my taste but this is a brave album, if you excuse the pun, because it was a concept album when uh, concept albums weren't particularly in vogue, if you like. But nevertheless, it did well. I think it got to number ten in the UK charts, which is uh, which is great, I think, for Marillion at this time. Move that over a bit. Lovely, absolutely lovely paper. I mean, I can't uh, stress. Uh, those of you who are fans of Marillion have probably already bought this. But those who haven't, I, um, I would highly recommend you go and buy this. It's just absolutely stunning um, quality. Um, in fact, I'm going to include a link in the, just under this video for you to click on and actually go right ahead and buy this item. That's of course where they recorded the album. I think the album was actually recorded in uh, the Dordogne, uh, Bordeaux area of France. Um, and in fact, I would recommend that this album is listened to accompanied by a full bodied red. That's wine, by the way. Um, but yes, and, uh, of course, that's where they actually recorded it. It's um, quite gothic looking, isn't it? It sort of lends itself well to the whole overall concept of the album, which is quite dark. Um, really, obviously, that's some actually recording the, uh, recording the album. Mr. Ian Mosley, just Ian Mosley there. Wonderful, wonderful. Um, obviously, these I think are stills from from the video. Really, it's. Uh, I mean, you already know about this. Of course, the the album, of course, was inspired by a young girl found wandering across a bridge. I think it was in London. I could be wrong. And, and she she couldn't give her name or she didn't speak. And it was kind of like a page of a mystery novel, really. And Marillion just picked that up. Wonderful. I've not actually um, listened to it yet, uh, so I couldn't really comment on, on the overall sound, but I must admit I, I have been very pleased with the Stephen Wilson mixes of the Tull, um, the Tull reissues and these ones, of course, but um, I, I've heard some criticisms of the, of the Stephen Wilson mixes, but I, I must assume that the band actually gets to hear what he does and must approve it. And of course, you know, an album like Aqualung, for example, he's pulled out a lot of stuff that was in the periphery or sort of lost to in, in sort of subsequent mixes. And I, I'm really, I really anticipate that he's done a cracking job with this as well. Actually, I'm looking forward to seeing Marillion really next month, I think, in Cambridge, going with my daughter. If you see me there, please say hello. It's absolutely fabulous. I mean, the, the of course, here we go, all the lyrics to the songs. Lovely. The opening then. Oh, 
Hard as Love. What a great song that is. I must admit, I do. I also love the version that's on the um, the, uh, the the acoustic version they do as well, which is, it is absolutely fabulous. I'm so looking forward to giving this a listen. Hollow Man, what a what a wonderful song that is. Isn't that the Hollow Man? I think it's uh, is that not lifted from a T. S. Eliot poem? I think it is. The Great Escape, what a great song that is. I won't sing it for you. And here we get what's actually on here, of course, we get the um, disc one, of course, we get the Stephen Wilson remix. Uh, I'm really looking forward to hearing that. Uh, and we also get the, um, for the completers, you can juxtapose that with the original mix as well. Um, Dixery live at uh, La Cigale, um, I hope I pronounced that right, which is interesting as well. I don't think that's been released. And the Blu-ray of course, which is, obviously has the um, uncompressed audio uh, and a 70 docu minute documentary. Who could ask for more? Let's have a look at the discs. What is this? This is the Blu-ray, I believe. It is the the Blu-ray. Pop that back in there. And there we have the CDs. We have uh, two CDs at the start as well, of course. It's a four CD set. And that's in there. What a wonderful, wonderful item. It makes us uh, certainly look forward to the um, future Meridian reissues. I can't wait for season's end, to be honest with you. But that's absolutely fabulous. Again, uh, I'm at the risk of repeating myself, I'll, I'll, you know, I'll say what I said at the beginning, that it's um, uh, a, a, really, a real sort of quality uh, item, really. And um, I, I do, I do think it, what, what's great about this album is that it, it was a, as I said, it was a concept album at a time when concept albums were, were certainly not in vogue. I think it was a real uh, brave step for the band, uh, one that I think paid off because it's an album that's uh, subsequently become uh, more and more highly regarded. So it certainly warranted uh, uh, the treatment that it's been given here. Anyway, you've been watching an unboxing. Um, if you're a hardcore Marillion fan, I suspect you've already gone out and bought this. If you're thinking about buying it, I would, I would say just go out and buy it. It's absolutely fabulous. I will, in, I will include a link for you to purchase this item at the just below this video. So, well, I get it for a loved one or yourself or whatever. Anyway, thank you for watching. Please click like and subscribe. Check out the Facebook page. But more importantly, please do keep listening.